Hey, hey, good morning, Bill. Hi, Alex. So I'm here with Rich Hart from Hart Services in Tacoma, Man, a plumber that's actually teaching us how to take care of our pipes. Earlier this morning, we made a toilet bowl cleaner and an all-purpose cleaner, but you swear that this drain cleaner is like the best thing ever and we can uh, make it at home. Absolutely. It's super fun, super cheap. Um, it's a great way to be preventative instead of reactive. We've all had plug drains yeah. and it's not a fun situation. It's we gotta not call a plumber, yada yada. And pay a lot this of is, money. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so we can actually do this on a regular basis, I would say once a month or so. Just dump it down the drains, whether it's your shower drain, your sink drain in the bathroom, kitchen sink drain. Okay. And what it'll do is it'll actually help prevent and maintain gunky buildup from sticking inside of your pipes. But this is just salt. This is just salt. So okay. we got just regular iodized salt here. We've got some vinegar and we've got some baking soda. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and you can go ahead and be in the mixer. Okay. And Mixing. you know, this isn't in a sink, so it might be like a volcano here. We got Oh, we're doing science oh, this yeah, morning. This is going to be super fun. So okay. we got one cup of baking soda and one cup of salt in the bowl so now. So do I need to mix this before I put this in the drain? Give it a little bit of mix. At the end okay. of the day, what you're going to do is you're going to take this dry material and you're going to dump it into the drain Okay. And, and then and then add the vinegar. Okay, because... Because if you do it in the bowl, this might happen. You okay. ready? Okay, yeah. All oh, right, no. let's see what happens okay. here. Oh, God! Oh. <laughs> Oh. It cleaned the inside of the bowl really yeah, nice, yeah. though, too. So you see it's bubbling and stuff. What it's doing is it's acting a lot like, like an Alka-Seltzer or something inside of the pipe. And it's kind of fuzzing up in there. And we're going to let that sit for maybe like three to five minutes. Interesting. Walk away, go have a sip of coffee or whatnot, come back, and yeah. then let's run some hot water down through it. So now, again, like... I can buy these cleaners at the store. Yeah, absolutely. Um, they're going to cost me more than actually making them, right? But yep. you had said that those are bad for your pipes. They are. So what they are is you'll notice on the bottles of those uh, products is there's a skull of crossbones on them. As plumbers, we are trained very well to smell it when we walk in the door. Oh. It'll actually burn your skin. And it's oh. no different from burning your skin, it'll burn your pipes. Right. Over time of use of that, it'll mm -hmm. erode your pipes down to where you start getting holes and leaks and whatnot. Got it. So for someone, let's say, you know, like maybe a dad raising a lot of girls and they have a lot of hair that's yeah. clogging up the drains. Now, to prevent this, how often did you say that we should put this down our drains? Now, I have all boys. If I had girls, my wife, I would say every couple weeks. Okay, yeah. a couple weeks. Yeah. Got it. It's super cheap. I mean, we all know a box of baking soda is like a buck. And right. A thing of salt is maybe two or three bucks, a thing of vinegar. And, and we're one cup of each, just to reiterate that. Yeah. Um, so every couple of weeks. Yeah, every couple of weeks should be fine. If you're a regular household and there's not a lot of girls or just a, a couple, I would say, <laughs> um, I would say probably once every month or two would be fine even. Yeah. Now, if in case you missed it, I missed the segments earlier this morning. We did do a Facebook Live on the Q13 Facebook page where Rich and Maria, who also works here too, she is the brains behind all of this stuff, uh, came up with the cleaner recipe and the toilet cleansers too. So if you want to go check that out, it is up right now on our Q13 Facebook page. Rich, thank you so much. Absolutely. Guys, back on over to you.